The Breakfast Moment with Shepherd James Haimba. Those who seek the Lord diligently will find him. <coughs> and remember, kuna vitabu zingine ya mob sana zenye zinaongea juu ya God. Zenye bado hata ziko kwa, kwa Bible. Sikia kina Jasha, the book of uh, Chronicles, the book of the Covenant and all those other books zenye ziko. Bado tu kwa Bible zimekuwa referred to. Ni kama you see, um, the, the times you read some books and uh, they'll tell you that this is documented in my, in our volume 2 or in our another book called this and this. So for you to understand that thing, you need to get that other book so that you can understand it. Ni kama ukipewa story, for example, uambiwe um, kama na, 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 na mtu mluya. Like a lawyer guy comes and tells you, I slept like that, meaning lala ivi. You know, you might think they mean they just slept on the floor or something. They just slept like that. But you wouldn't really me- understand what like that means. But to a fellow lawyer who understands, they will understand, they will decode the message because that message is coded. They will decode it and they will understand that this person means they did not eat. They slept hungry. So the, the, the word of God is a mystery by itself. And uh, it's important for you to know that the Bible entirely is not the scripture. Because even the Bible itself refers to other scripture. And you see Paul says in 2 Timothy 3 that uh, all scripture is good and is, uh, is profitable for teaching or doctrine and all that for correction. So you realize that many people will not be willing to find the truth about God. They will find a small verse here and run with it and use it to fight the things they don't know yeah so it is important for you to desire to walk with god